Hello guys, I am Flash Isaac and I'm here to solve this question. The question says, find sum to infinity of the series 1 over 2, then minus 1 over 4, plus 1 over 8, minus 1 over 16, plus dash dash. The series continues and these are the options. Option A says 1, option B says 2, option C says 2 over 3, and option D says it is 1 over 3. What do you think is the correct answer? To find sum to infinity, sum to infinity is simply A over 1 minus R. What is A and what is R? A is simply first term. The first term that appeared in this series. In this series, the first term is obviously 1 over 2. This is the first thing that appeared. So we simply come and say A is equals 1 over 2. Arrow is the common ratio. Common ratio is the value you get when you divide a value by the previous value. For example, this is first value, second term, third term, fourth term, and so on. Now, if we divide this second term by the first term, we'll get the same answer if we also divide the third term by the second term, or we divide the fourth term by the third term. So any number you take and divide by the previous number, it should get the same answer. That is what common ratio is about. For example, if I pick the second term, which is minus 1 over 4, divided by 1 over 2, the answer is simply minus 1 over 4 times 2 over 1. When you are changing division to multiplication, you simply invert the other number there. This will give you minus 2 over 4, which is 1 over 2, minus 1 over 2. So uh, my common ratio is minus 1 over 2. You may be wondering, is Ojoro try the other numbers? No problem at all. Let's do that. If I say, okay, third term divided by second term. Third term is 1 over 8 divided by second term, which is minus 1 over 4. This will simply give you 1 over 8 times minus 4 over 1. 1 times minus 4 is minus 4. And 8 times 1 is 8. This will simply give you minus 1 over 2 when you break it down. So in any way you go about it, common ratio remains the same. Now we've gotten everything we need. Food is ready. We simply say uh, sum to infinity is equals first term 1 over 2, then 1 minus, we already have minus 1 over 2 here. So you have to take note of that sign to avoid errors. Sum to infinity becomes 1 over 2 all over 1 Minus times minus is plus. So here has changed to plus 1 over 2. So simplifying, 1 plus 1 over 2, if you look for the LCM, you get 2 plus 1 over 2. This will give you 1 over 2 over 3 over 2. To make this division easier for you, you can simply say 1 over 2 divided by 3 over 2. Then change the multiplication to have 1 over 2 times 2 over 3. This will give you 1 times 2 is 2, 2 times 3 is 6. So your answer should be 1 over 3. That is the sum to infinity of this series. 1 over 3. Correct. Thank you for watching my video. I am Flash Isaac. Feel free to subscribe to this channel, Flash Learners, to get my updates on new videos. And don't forget to check out my other videos. Visit flashlearners.com slash videos or search Flash Learners on YouTube to see my amazing videos for all your topics. I really appreciate your time. Thank you.